The Nightlock Lockdown Safety Shade will block the view during an emergency lockdown event. These blackout shades are perfect on school campuses and office buildings. The Nightlock Lockdown Safety Shade attaches to the door using industrial strength Velcro adhesive. It's important to clean the door surface prior to installation. To install the Nightlock Safety Shade, remove the Velcro hook portion with the adhesive backing from the shade. Peel off the protective layer from the adhesive backing. Then, center this Velcro with adhesive above the window and press firmly. It is recommended to use a roller tool to ensure complete adhesion. Roll firmly to remove any bubbles. It is important to wait 24 hours before attaching the safety shade. 24 hours later, attach the safety shade. Again, use the roller tool to completely connect the Velcro. Roll firmly. When rolling up your shade, it is held in place with a Velcro strip. Press firmly. To quickly activate your safety shade, pull down on the strap. Larger shades have two straps. Nightlock Lockdown Safety Shades come in 10 standard sizes to accommodate most windows. Custom sizes are also available. Here's a few good tips when you're installing a Nightlock Lockdown window shade. Make sure the surface is dry and clean. The Velcro hook with the adhesive backing uh, that comes with every shade goes up first. And what you want to do, you want to start peeling from one end. Stick it on there. Just lay it as you go, a little at a time, nice and straight. Try to cover the window frame as much as you can. Press firmly to make sure there's no bubbles. So we recommend using a roller like this to get maximum adhesion. So you can get really good pressure with that. Pushing out any bubbles. Now let this set for at least 24 hours before you attach the window shade. So it's been at least 24 hours. So we're gonna get the shade ready to put up. I'm gonna unroll it here. And stretch it out all the way. Okay, so I'm gonna bring it up here, line it up with the top edge of the Velcro. I'm holding this side out while I do it. And then that way I get it nice and even across the top. And most important is pressing it really well. The best way to get that hook and loop pressed together is with a roller. Then just roll it up nice and straight. Just like this, the Velcro patches meet. And just press it nice and firm. So you're going to want to make sure that you don't have any obstructions, you know, too close to the window when you deploy the shades. Um, we're going to deploy this here. You'll see now there's a clear gap right there. Somebody could still see in there because of that Scrabble box. Now, if you have something like this file cabinet too close to the window, it's going to stop the shade. So you want to keep them, you know, four or five inches away from the window. So make sure your classroom decorations don't interfere with the deployment of the shade. When it comes down, you'll see simple little decorations like that can, can hold the shade out and create a gap where the bad guy can look in. Check out the Nightlock Lockdown Safety Shades at nightlock.com.